Okay. How is how I built my clock? Look. Master LED. Sending light signal. Is sending light signal. Okay. Light sensor. Register energy. I mean how many joule per war one second are received? Light sensor not measure the time, only count a uh, joule. One joule equal one second or oh, one joule equal zero 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 one second, okay? Distance A and uh, LED power you can calibrate. For example, one one joule equal one second. Okay. What what is very important? This is the Earth or other coordinating system, Windows less locket or any other coordinating system. This clock have to be parallel. Light sensor have to be parallel to main velocity. This is how work clock. Right now I will explain you one joule equal one second, one joule equal one second. What you think? If V zero will rising to for example right now is ten meter per second and after ten meter per second this uh, velocity will rise to constant velocity zero point five C speed. I mean, what's happened? You have to build very big sensor, but this very big sensor will see the same light power, will measure the same joule. Why? Area will be very big, yes, but a joule will be the same. Luminous intensity in small part of uh, light sensor, one pixel, for example, in photo camera is one pixel. Photo camera chip is built with many many point. Uh, have many point. Photo camera has many point. Photo camera, photo camera's chips chip have many point. Uh, Nikon that I use my camera, I use Nikon. Uh, nine nineteen thousand point. Nineteen thousand point. So this area will rising. Look, next picture will explain this better. Okay. Okay. Right, right now we have a um, we have a uh, clock and we measure the time. For example, uh, V0 constant velocity is equal to this, 0.5 C, or V0 is equal to this. What will happen if you have parallel, ideal parallel direction, if you keep this parallel direction, this clock always will show the same jewel. If clock will be perpendicular it's depend depend because this position clock will be slow down and this position clock will be accelerate why because this position have influence on distance a distance a you just calibrate so exists only specific distance A and specific power of light source that give you this one joule equal one second. But when you put perpendicular this clock to main velocity with zero, you just rising this distance rising or this distance A is more shorter. It's a natural. So very important is V0 and very important is direction of clock to V0.
I will right now I will compare atomic clock oh sorry Okay, here we have compare between atomic clock and my clock. Where is atomic clock? Bohr atom model, one uh, Vodore, okay? In totally zero position, totally zero point. What is totally zero point? I already explained that we can measure by uh, light, we can measure by uh, Doppler effect, we can uh, make internal Doppler effect and then we will recognize uh, zero point. This is a master coordination system with absolutely zero velocity. Stationary point A in the universe we have here. I already showed I already invented five independent methods to recognize and also uh, explain you mathematic equation that will show you dynamic, classical mechanic, but dynamic will show you where is that point. This point not exists, it's a virtual zero only, only for evaluate velocity, but very important vir virtual zero that we have to add. Why? Look, this is atomic clock. When, when you accelerate, you made ellipse. You made ellipse. 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 Question: Do you made ellipse or do you see ellipse? That's the main question. You just made ellipse. V zero, if rising. What, what, what is the problem with atomic clock? I don't know. I just right now showing you only one direction of move this electron. But this electron can go any, can be anywhere, any place around the atom. And I don't know exactly area where, I don't know exactly where it is. He can be also perpendicular to this direction. So perpendicular, one time he will be perpendicular, one time parallel, one time per per perpendicular, one time parallel. So this is a mistake. In my clock, in zero, you have perfect cycle. When accelerate, for example, this is not acceleration, but constant V0, I'm sorry. the point of light rising the point of light rising but area in this this area of this cycle equal area of this ellipse equal area of this ellipse this ellipse can be very long very big this is light light sensor will see very big ellipse but many point if you add point by point will give you the same Joe in the same time. So this clock will never make a mistake. Look, this is LED and LED always go always light beam always have some beam. Light beam always have some angle. This is constant velocity. If constant velocity rising this light sensor will see more bigger ellipse. More bigger ellipse more bigger ellipse but this atomic clock will <laughs> register different period different period different period different period different forces inside atom we have forces that we don't don't know 100% don't know nobody can evaluate nobody can calibrate perfect calibrate atomic clock okay I would like to, this is how you can compare luminous intensity, because my clock measures luminous intensity, and this is how you compare with 
gravitation forces. This is gravitation intensity. Forces mean gravitation intensity. Why gravitation is resistant for uh, velocity change? Because we have double body. Similar like in Doppler, body number one and body number two is R sending in one time gravitation signal. If we have velocity like this, or if we have velocity opposite, is no meaning for gravitation forces. Why? Because strong of these forces were rising and this will be fall down. The force of this uh, gravitation body will fall down. The forces of this gravitation will rise. But when velocity will be opposite, this mass gravitation will rise, density, density, and this gravitation force forces will fall down. You can explain by Doppler effect this body and this body sending a wave much more longer or much more shorter, much more longer or much more shorter, depend on velocity, coordinating system velocity.